Commander Castellon's list had over 40 names on it. Men, women, the elderly and children. They were all civilians. They weren't killed in combat. They were ruthlessly shot as part of the repression in Zafra. They were the first of close on 200 who were murdered in the Extremadura village in the first months of the war. The troops who rebelled on the 18th of July 1936 quickly occupied Andalusia and most of Extremadura. The advancing columns soon showed the kind of barbarity to be expected of a Spanish colonial army trained in Africa. The battles were often soon over, but the troops took their time in sowing terror and death in the villages and cities that fell to them. General Chiepo Deliano went on Seville radio daily to threaten death and destruction to those defending the beleaguered republic. Con harto dolor de mi corazón, tengo que comunicar que sigue el castigo a los pueblos que ciegos obedecen todavía las órdenes de esos miserables directivos marxistas. A todos les recuerdo que por cada persona honrada que muera, yo fusilaré por lo menos diez. Y hay pueblos donde hemos rebasado esta cifra. Y no esperen los dirigentes salvarse, pues los sacaré de debajo de la tierra si es preciso. <risa> 